builder characteristically choosing to remain silent. But this time, the buyers won't. Our next citizen journalist is Raj Gaur. He invested in a property with ERA landmark. Now, five years and 35 lakh rupees later, not a brick has been laid in his project. The very intent of the builder came into question when it was later revealed that they didn't even have the requisite permissions from the district town planning commission. Citizens like Raj had no option but to file an FIR against the builder. It has thus become a long drawn battle for their own life savings, even as they know that the dream of owning a home is as good as gone. Mehek Zubair is helping Raj turn a citizen journalist. I am Raj Gaur. I have become a citizen journalist today for CJ+. I booked a flat in the Ira Landmark Limited in 2011. It was September 2011 when I paid 5,50,000 check to the Ira. My agent shows me very rosy pictures and said that this, this project is going to be completed within three years. Say, 14 or maximum 2015. Till now, there is no construction at all. They kept demanding, they kept sending the demand letters and I kept paying. Till now, I have paid 35 lakh some rupees to them. This is what the construction site looks like today. These pictures that I clicked on the morning of 21st April 2016, five years after I booked my flat, will help you understand the gravity of the situation. But the delay was not the worst that was in store. On 31st March 2015, the District Town Planning Commission filed an FIR and the case was taken to the High Court. The builder, ERA Landmark Limited, or what is now known as Arel Landmark Limited, had started selling off the flats even before they got the permission from the District Town Planning Commission. They got the permission in 2012, which is completely illegal according to the law of District Town Planning Commission. Chairman H.S. Bharana has been arrested under that case. Worried for our investment, some of his buyers decided to confront the senior management. But there were no answers. Instead, we were intimidated. Which is when I decided to file an FIR. When I went to the Gurgaon police, I saw many people standing there with the same problem as I was. Then we made a complaint to the police commissioner, which has been converted later into the FIR. There are more than 50, 60 FIR, and the complainant are thousands. The law is now taking its course. The chairman was once again arrested. The session court denied the bail. Even session court has mentioned in their denying order that this case seems to be like Sahara group and denied their bail. Then he went to the High Court Chandigarh. I am 67 year old now and my health is not that good because I had in 2012 I had two stunts inserted in my heart. The case is going on in Chandigarh. I have to run all the time to Chandigarh. Throughout life I've been struggling and my all money is gone with them. Now they are enjoying and I am running pillar to post to recover my own money like a beggar. I want immediate action and my money to be refunded by the Ira Landmark Company with interest. Citizen journalists for CJ Plus and CNN News 18. <laughs>